Hello everybody, welcome back to another Pixel Worlds video. I know, but uh, I, I can be allowed to change. You see, I did say if some updates happened, I would come back to the game and well, not exactly an update happened, but a little Instagram post by the name of 6 Gay today. And, uh, don't tell anybody, don't tell anybody. Uh, the wiring contest winners, the wiring contest winners. So the winning worlds are all listed here along with the people who won them. So today we're gonna go through the list and uh, we're gonna see some really cool wiring worlds. So let's put on the furry headphones and get right into this. All right, so the first one, let's go from bottom to top. So first we have Etch-A-Sketch, which as a friend of Gargoyle, I actually have been to. Uh, it's a really good world. Um, basically you're able to literally, oh, well, I haven't rated five. You're able to literally draw. So let me show you. You can press the reset, which is this and it goes up and around. Let's see if I can make a square. This is where the cursor is, by the way, and this is the actual drawing over here. Uh, all right, and then we go left and then up. And then we can save it, I think. And now it won't change it. Yeah, so you can change where the cursor goes. Now I can change it to go over here. And then up like that and then we can make a little we can uncheck it and then now it's uh, free again and then there we go uh, and then we can do that again there and then uncheck it and there we go see so we made a little design there and you can do that for so many things uh, you can actually apply this to a bigger design if you do it like six by six uh, five by five six by six ten by ten you can do this for so many designs you could probably make a full anime pixel art with just uh, Etch-A-Sketch design, uh, design. So the wiring is really cool. Um, I actually don't know if you can see the wiring on another person's thing. No, you can't, but uh, pretty cool design. 10th place, it seems like, from Gargoyle. Oh, is that a butterfly? Hold up. Ma Empress, bro, Empress is like 100 by coin. Yo, let's go. The next one is Hoovy Puisto, like that. He made a wiring world as well. Um, it looks to be a mini game world. Uh, and it's in Finnish actually. So, I'm not sure where the wiring is. Let me find it. Oh, it could be right here. Uh, so it looks like I'm loading in and then I get pushed in and it's a parkour potentially. All right, yeah, so it's a parkour that I can do fast, I, th I guess. Uh, it's wired. I'm just too good at the game, by the way, so uh, not going to be too hard. Bro, I didn't miss a jump. Oh! oh, it has to be really fast. Wow. Okay. Let's try that again. There is difficult, man. Yeah, that jump is difficult. Oh, that's toxic. Oh, this is so, this is so lame. All right, nice. Got through it. Uh-oh. I think there's a, it's a time aspect to it. Oh no, I don't know the password. Oh. Cloudy wire. Uh, oh, it's got a bunch of mini games. So we're not gonna play all these, especially since I have to go. Uh, but uh, let's try level four dodge. Uh, looks like it's locked. Let's try double dodge. Um, is it on a timer, maybe? Let's try, uh, I'm not sure if it's gonna work. Alright, let's respawn. Let's try Trapper Game. Not sure how you do this one either, but that's okay. Let's try Death Run. Oh, you can mess with the other person. I like that aspect. That automatically gives me a, gives it a pass. I like that a lot. You can control it for other people. This looks like more of a, a friend or team world. Uh, that you'd have to have people to go to, but um, that's pretty cool. I like it. All right, next one is Pizzle, Pixel Prison. I've actually been here. I know Jack Byron, and uh, I've actually been to Pixel Prison. He showed me this a long time ago before it was even finished. And it has to, a lot to do with wiring. And so, got to do some swimming. Could have done dialogue, but that's okay. 
This is part of the prison they'll no longer in use. They'll never catch us now. Uh, I'll make it, I'll make it. Oh, no damage. You should definitely check this world out. I do not have enough time to go through the entire thing, but uh, it is a great, great wired world. Next we have Gar Goyle, spell like that. Gargoyle is again, the master of wiring. He's just literally the best. So uh, if you're ever looking for who to, to, to know how to wire, go to his YouTube channel because he just knows. He's just so good. I'm not exactly sure how this works, to be honest, but uh, definitely check it out. Next is Clock 24, and I actually think I have this world favorited. Yeah, I do. Um, it's literally a clock. 325, 326, like it just keeps going. It's insane. Um, and you see, clock runs 60 times faster than normal for demonstrational purposes. Left digits hours right here, right digits is minutes. So this is actually seconds, and then this is minutes. Uh, but it's meant to mimic actual time. So that's about 13 minutes. It's an insane, insanely cool thing. It's literally a clock. So definitely go check out clock 24 hours, basically is what it means. Clock 24 if you want to see a clock in Pixel Worlds, because it's very cool. All right, now we can go to boss fight. This is actually made by my friend Caleb, who's also in Clash. He actually got me into Clash. And uh, I haven't been to this world yet, so I have no idea what to expect. Um. Oh, whoops. It was going to fight then. Start then. Okay. Let's get into it. So it's literally a box fight, boss fight of wiring. That's so cool. Whoa. Oh. That's intense. Let's try that one more time. Uh oh, okay. We almost moved into the next room. <laughs> Alright. We made it, so let's go down. Oh no, we, we died. Alright. Definitely check out boss fight if you want to have a cool boss fight with wiring. Now let's go to Alien Invasion. Oh, Alien Invasion. By Pyroset. Hold up. Alien Vacion. Oh, here we go. Looks like it's another boss fight world. That's pretty cool. It looks like there's a uh, little boss fight mechanic over there, um, but that's pretty cool. So uh, let's go to the last two, second place and first place. Looks like you can get these prizes. Um, automatically spins once every full hour. Oh, cool. Get a free prize every hour. Oh wait, this is cursed because you, you can't trade world locks anymore. So they actually put a world lock in a prize box. That's insane. They should just keep that. And uh, that's by Gargoyle, but it looks like it was just owned by LMO. Nowadays, uh, he gave it to him for the challenge. And uh, the final first place I've never been here is Hike. Oh, it's by Hikes. Whoops, I went to the wrong place. The last one is Tech Game. I wonder what made it first place. Maybe with a sudden idea and creativity. Oh, there's a lot of rules. I'm just gonna see if I can do it. You can 1v1 as a character. You can crouch, you can uh, jolt forward, you can run, sidekick, you can jump attack, and you can jump. That's so cool. Oh my gosh, that is insanely cool. I would definitely have chosen this as first place. This is amazing. That's all the winners of the wiring contest. Of course, like I've shown, there's a lot more to each of these, and uh, there's so much to do, especially probably in uh, Huvo Piusto. There's a lot of mini games there, uh, but there's so many creative ideas. I mean, look at this. It's literally a 1v1 mechanic. Uh, you can crouch, you can jump, you can uh, punch the other person. It's so creative, and uh, that's just what you guys have to consider. You know, Pixel Worlds has so much creative potential with wiring. Definitely consider making some wiring worlds of your own. I may check them out on my channel, and uh, this may or may not be the last Pixel Worlds video I make, but I definitely wanted to check out and support my friends' worlds, uh, specifically Caleb and Gargoyle. Uh, but congratulations to all the winners, and uh, I am so excited to see some more Wiring Worlds. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.